We want to compare all the products we are manufacturing. But the problem is we don't have any data describing the product. We have the data describing the life condition of the plant. Imagine that you're stuck because of the complexity of what you're doing and whatever you tried, you didn't find the sweet spot. What we want to do is, is not a digital twin of the design of the product, but we want to use real life data from the plant, from all the equipment, and we want to be able to recalculate the exact condition of manufacturing of every product. Every product is unique. Every product is described by thousands of variables. When we capture this variability at the product level, we build all this digital twin. Then the big challenge is to be able to find the inputs that really generate the variability on the outputs. And that's what BrainCube is providing. So the way we do it is we will capture what really happens at the product level. We go to customers that all manufacture products, but they don't know how they really manufacture problem, products. They know the status of the machines, they know some measure about their product. And what you brought on this market is something unique, is we capture at the product level the real viability of all the inputs that matters for the customer, like their cost, like their quality, like energy consumption. And we, we also capture the variability of the inputs. So BrainCube has this unique capability of recalculating this viability at the product level. And we have a perfect machine learning technology that will identify what to do to uh, solve the complex problems. BrainCube is different than the other company in the space because we started by the end. I mean, we started by building a multi-factor technology that really so solved the problem, that answers the question. And our challenge was to connect this AI technology to the plant. All the other suppliers, they started from the machine and they say, let's start to collect data, let's start to store data, and we'll see if one day somebody is bringing an application that is capable of doing something with it. And you choose where you want to connect BrainCube. You can connect BrainCube with all the solution, you can connect BrainCube with the BrainCube platform. It's up to you. This is a different question. It's an IT question. But at the end, when you have a BrainCube, your data generates something. They are not just a potential. They are results.